Hello everyone. As the whole world seems to hate Muslims, and probably you're thinking what I'm gonna say next or new. If you see what happened in this earth right now, what happening was our Prophet Muhammad peace be upon him, his guideline was wrong. If we followed that guideline, probably we wouldn't face this pandemic right now. As a illiterate person he was, he gave us some valuable guideline which could guide us to live a peaceful life. But we human, we always like to do the extreme and opposite. So we try and try. And when we face trouble, we ask God to forgive. In five, six minute video, I cannot put up so many explanation or example, but I'll try my best to give few or particularly about coronavirus. What happened to this earth right now? It's, it's a big catastrophe. It's a big disaster. If we follow the guideline from the beginning, probably we wouldn't see corona pandemic right now. As we all know, Corona came from an animal which we are not supposed to eat, but we human we like to try extreme things, and we we do all the nasty things possible, or even we try something which is not possible by humankind, but we still want to try. So we have so many food, so many good foods to eat, but we don't do them. We instead try all the nasty food as chinese we all know they eat whatever moves they eat probably after a few months or year they will start to eat raw water or sea ice or even poop and some part of china they already start to use poop in medical or in medicine or in some other purpose so soon they will come into them as you know poop coffee or coffee named copa liuk which is also a big expensive coffee they found it to be delicacy but i don't know so i never tried so i don't know and it's very expensive and as we all know they like to eat insects or worms or maggots instead of eating meat or fish or vegetable and then come to europe or america as i have seen on tv or heard about it in norway some part in norway in university they were promoting insects to be the main source of protein for humankind even in america there is some restaurant which is very popular because of the insects. Their main dish or main menu is burger made of insects. Now, Europe and America, along with China, they were trying to promote all the stupid things that human beings shouldn't eat. But they're just trying to do the opposite, as I mentioned earlier. Now, if you see we Muslim, terrorist or the nasty or bad people or women torturer or slaughterer whatever you like to say we follow simple guideline from our illiterate prophet muhammad peace be upon him and we are still doing it and we feel proud to do it and we will do it as long we say god is only one so if you see, we Muslim we eat only the food which is scientifically proven to be good for human, not for animal, because insects, we feed them to our duck or chicken, and then we eat the chicken, not we eat the insects and we leave our duck to be wandering around the backyard, or we don't eat raw grasses and leave our cattle to just live like a human and we become animal. We human are free to do whatever we want, especially in Western countries. I'm not gonna say in some other part of the world as we 
or you Westerners call them third third world so they are probably you can even speak the truth but come to the point in Western country you're free to do whatever you want you're free to eat whatever you want it does not mean I have to eat shit it means just eat whatever you want but choose from the menu book not from the toilet now in Western country we eat the good food but we go along with good food we go for advertised food which is shown on TV or on magazine it looks good so eat it okay insects look good but they are poisonous and as soon we understand we'll be out of trouble because science if we don't believe in religion we at least believe science and science does not support human to eat shitty food as example bats or insects or snakes or uh, earthworms we are allowed to eat food which is good for human which is made for human if we become like China or those Chinese people or uh, Vietnam or other Chinese looking people and we start to eat all the crappy food then we probably gonna see more pandemics every year because this time it happens from bats probably next year it will happen from other insects and then after next year it will happen from some other stuff but if you follow the guideline of science don't follow Islam if you follow the guideline of science you probably will stay without getting sick and without being afraid of going outside meeting your own mother and father if you use your thought then think before you eat just eat something which is good for your health not by seeing some crappy country or crappy person eating so eat the food you wish to eat but not the food from the toilet from garbage eat the good food